Hello students, welcome to the session. I hope you all are doing good. Our topic for today is comprehension. In this session, we will understand what is a comprehension and how we will use it in our English grammar. Comprehension is a kind of a story or a passage that tells about us, about a story, about a person, about a fact or situation. Comprehension generally comes in the passage or in the paragraph form. After comprehension, we will find some questions related with the paragraph or the comprehension passage and we need to solve that. This helps us to understand completely. It helps to make and build our understanding. Comprehension are very helpful in reading as well. Let us start reading the comprehension and then we will try to solve the questions. I will tell you what are the points to keep in mind while solving the comprehension passage. Let us first read the comprehension. Here the passage is about the apple tree. Grandchildren were sitting in the shade of a big tree in front of his house. The grandchildren were happily munching the delicious apples from the tea. Who planted this tree? Grandfather asked one of the children. Come, I will tell you how this tree came to be here, said the grandfather. As you can get the general idea here, it is about the apple tree. They are children, they are grandfather who is telling how the tree is being planted. Hey, he began, I came to live here more than 50 years ago. One day I was standing just about where this apple tree now stands. I was complaining to my neighbor that I had no money. Oh, I said, how happy I would be if I had a lot of money. The neighbor who was very wise man said to me, it is so simple. All you need to do is to begin well. Right where you are standing hidden in the ground are hundreds of rupees. It's up to you. You dig them out. So, unke neighbor ne kya kaha? Ki it is very simple. It is up to you that how you become to be rich. There are hundreds of rupees buried. Dig and take it out of them. I was then a young man without much understanding. The next day I dug a hole in the ground but I found nothing. The next morning when my neighbor saw the hole he began to laugh. Foolish man, I didn't mean that you had to dig a hole. Now I will tell you what I actually meant. The neighbor then gave an apple sapling and said take this, plant it in the hole you have dug. Look it after well, when this sapling becomes big you will start getting money. The apple plant will reward you. I planted the apple sapling and looked after it well. The tree grew strong and over the years it has become the great tree that you see in front of you. I have been selling its fruit all these years. This tree has certainly given me back hundreds and hundreds of rupees. Even today I earn money by selling its delicious fruit. I never forgotten the lesson which my neighbor taught me. Little plants will grow to be a abundant fruit someday. If only you can take good care of the plants you have today. So students, we got to know about the idea of the passage. We got to know the details. Before solving the comprehension passage, always try to read the comprehension so that you get the gist of the poem, you get the idea of the poem. After that, read the poem carefully, thoroughly. Achche se poem ko padni hai after getting the idea. And then before solving the questions, when you read the questions, try to get the relevant idea from the passage. Here the first question is, what did the speaker give to the grandfather? So, jo speaker hai, unho ne grandfather ko kya diya tha? You can easily understand here ki relevant answer aapko kaha milega here in the paragraph you can find it out. So always try to find the relevant passage with the question and use keywords. Jo bhi keywords question me mention hai, try to find that in your answer. What did the speaker give to the grandfather? As we know by the story, the apple sapling. So you can write here the speaker gave to the grandfather apple sapling. What did grandfather do with the apple sapling? Unhone us apple sapling se kya kya tha? They planted it, take care of it and made the tree. How did grandfather earn money from the apple tree? We know by selling the apple and fruits of the tree. We got the idea that it became a 
ग्रेट ट्री आई हैव बीन सेलिंग इट फ्रूट्स ऑल दीज इयर्स तो उन्होंने फ्रूट्स बेचे थे वॉट लेसन डू वी लर्न फ्रॉम दिस स्टोरी दैट इफ वी टेक केयर ऑफ प्लांट्स गुड we will be very rich in our coming future and also we should plant trees we should take good care of it because they are very helpful for us so this is the moral of the story so this is the moral of the story i hope students you are now aware how to read the comprehension and how to solve the question always read the comprehension carefully so that you are able to answer the questions well that's all for today's session